All right, Board Pusher audience, for this week's episode, we are going to be setting up this Sean Maltail 8.5 Twin Tail. Geo 96 shape. Recently cracked one of my crooked boards. I only got about one session in on these trucks and wheels, so uh, gonna repurpose them, put them on this twin tail, and uh, give it a try. <laughs> off there and uh, let me dive into a little what we're doing for the setup here you got some Indy 149 hollows going with some 54 millimeter Spitfire 101A's uh, for bearings Let's see what I got in here got bones big balls in there they're a little dirty in need of a cleaning and uh, that's what we're gonna be doing. So let me bust this thing out the wrap, put some stickers on it, and. <laughs> sheet of some nine inch mob grip tape here. I'm gonna mark out my lines and put this grip on. I am a passenger. I stay under glass. I look through my window so bright. I see the stars come out tonight. To see the bright and hollow sky. The city's a ripback sky And everything looks good tonight Alright, we got the grip put on the board Just need to cut off the excess there And then we'll get this board set up Throw these trucks and wheels and everything on Peace. 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 Huh. peace, 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 Here, symmetrical, lines all in the same spots. Stickers in the same spots. Let's get it set up. Ocean, they dimming down the focus. The focus get cleared and the light turns sharp and the eyes grow teary. The mind grow weary. I speak it so clearly, sometimes y'all don't hear me. I push it past the base, no nations got to feel me. I feel it in my bones, black. I'm so wide awake that I'm hardly ever asleep. My flow forever deep and it's volumes of scriptures when I breathe on a beat. My presence speaks volumes before I say a word. I'm everywhere, penthouse, pavement, the curb. Alright, that's going to complete the setup of the 8.5 Sean Malto Twin Tail. It's uh, tune in for the park for a review. Alright, Ryan, so where are we at? Riverside? No. Riverview? We're at, we're at Providence Skate Park in Brandon, Florida right now. Oh, yeah, see, I don't know shit. You couldn't ask me a little change of scenery today. Let's uh, go in there, stretch, warm up, get some. Um, 
All right. Here at the skate park. Never been to this one before, so uh, unless I'm getting used to this board, gonna be getting used to the park as well. All right, so first impression on the twin tail. Feels like I'm skating my board backwards. Gonna get takes some getting used to. Checking in with Ryan Homan, Gunny Creation, Woo skating and painting on Instagram. Where are Bowser. we headed, bud? Where are we at? Where are we headed? We are at Apollo Beach. Yeah, Apollo Beach. And we're going to Hawk Trail. Fish Hawk. Fish Hawk. <laughs> Never been there. You can tell. Uh, Don't even know the name. The Fish Hawk Skate Park. Should yep. be great. Good old time. I've only been the once, so uh, we're gonna go out there if I can rip it up and get get some revs going. Check in with you all then. Whoop Cheers. Whoop. Here at Fishhawk Skate Park. I'm gonna film Ryan skating for a little bit. Oh my God. And he's gonna try a front side kick flip into it.
dog under me. Safe. And you got it on film. So that's going to complete this week's video. That was the 8.5 Sean Malto Girl Skateboards Twin Tail Skate Review. Uh, overall, I really liked that board. Will I be buying a Twin Tail again? Uh, perhaps. It's not something I necessarily seek after, after skating it, but it was a fun board and uh, it performed well in the park. I had no problem doing any of my tricks. Uh, the only downside was I set up trucks on there from a previous board, so I could definitely tell my back truck and my front truck apart when turning there. So didn't really get the full twin tail experience just because of that. But aside from that, awesome board. And uh, just want to thank you guys for watching. Hope everyone's been having a good week.